You know, Cindy was just telling me just last week how much she loved that last date I took her on. Hey, I got a bite. Wow, that's nice. Well, that is a dandy, Dave. The skunk out of the boat with that one, huh? Well, you must have taken Kim out on some good dates, haven't you? Last three years, I've taken her out for her birthday, and every time she's been disappointed. Just don't don't know what I'm doing wrong. Uh, matter of fact, was it three years ago now? I think uh, planned a perfect date, had it all set up. And gosh, I took her out to Prime Quarter. You know, they got that nice big grill in there and the oh, charcoal. Yeah. And for some reason, she didn't really want to cook that night. So anyway, two years ago, I uh, take her out bowling. I bought her a bowling ball a couple years ago. So it'd be perfect. She can go use her new bowling ball. And we hit the lanes, and boy, I tell you, I hit one of my best games ever, but she was pretty disappointed. She really didn't enjoy that. I don't know why she wouldn't enjoy that. I mean, not every guy will take his wife out bowling with a bowling ball you buy her. Well, you said the last three years, so what was the third one? Well, last year rolls around, and I figured, all right, skip the bowling. I knew she didn't want to cook for herself. She wanted somebody to serve her up a nice meal, so I figured, well, I'm going to do it right this time. So I let her pick the place, and I surprised her when we got there. I said, uh, your present this year is you get to plan our next big vacation, anywhere you want to go. How could you go wrong? That's right. So what happened? I pulled up the, the cost for two people to go on a nice cruise. And the dollar amount came back to me. It was about ten thousand dollars. So I said, "Hey, you know, let's do it. Let's do it." You know. So I get right there. I thought if we can sit down and get our budget figured out, we could have everything saved up and ready to go in about three years. So you kind of killed the moment by going over the budget while you were eating dinner? Is that what you're telling me? As far as perfect dates are concerned, you really should come up, come with me in this quick start thing that's coming up. It's like a quick start breakfast that we're starting. It's called um, M Squared. And uh, what it is, is just a bunch of guys getting together and, you know, just kind of like the fellowship thing and, you know, doing things every, you know, like once a month or something. And I'll tell you what, the first meeting that we're having, whoa, you got it? <sighs> well, at least you're getting nibbles. I lost him. Well, anyways, the topic is, is how to take your wife on the perfect date. But you said they're serving breakfast, right? They're, ser they're serving All breakfast. Right. And, right. I, and I'll tell you what, as your friend, I think you might want to come and check her out. Well, I uh, definitely need some help in that perfect date planning and if that's what the focus is, uh, it is I'd really like to find out more information about that in terms of where and when and you got all that yeah I do you know what as a matter of fact why don't we go inside and uh, I can show you the information oh. come on sounds good I don't think this is a very good fishing spot anyhow 